The main, the main thing is probably getting tracks finished. Uh, new album, uh, Scars. Uh, yeah. Scars, the title is about uh, um, yeah, scars that everybody gets during life. Um, uh, that's what I read. Mm -hmm. <laughs> is there, uh, yeah, how, how do those stories uh, end up on a dance record? Was, I don't know if the album, is it really a, a dance record? It's got elements of dance in it. Um, the the title track Scars, I mean, I suppose it's a, it's got elements of hip hop in it. It's got elements of classical music. Um, I mean, that was a song we had, and that wasn't the main idea that it was going to be Scars the album, but that sort of a song had the word Scars in, and it became one of the possible titles. And just talked about, yeah, probably there's a, there's a, a dark undercurrent to the whole album, and. Uh, and uh, which, with scars, I mean, scars can be funny scars or sexy scars, but generally there's, there's a dark undercurrent, but they kind of make us the people we are. Yeah. Yeah, are, there some, uh, are there certain songs that represent a, a certain scar in your life or maybe on your body? Or? Well, there's uh, definitely Saga and She's No Good talk about, uh, yeah, emotional and, and almost physical scars within a relationship. And uh, feelings gone, yeah. I suppose they're all more emotional or mental, yeah, yeah. than physical. Yeah. Um, w when you write a song about, when you make a song about uh, those uh, mental uh, mental scars, um, and it's probably very personal. Uh, what's the next step in finding uh, the right vocalist for such such a song? Well, it all depends on the song that we're doing. Uh, on this album there's a few tracks that are collaborations with the vocalists like Lightspeed Champion, he wrote the majority of that song that he did. Um, when we're finding a vocalist for a song, like with Feelings Gone, which is the next single in England, um, that song was in existence and Sam Sparrow, we heard that he was a fan of our music and um, he came to the studio and just tried that song and it sounded good, he liked the song, we liked his voice, it all came together and it worked. Sometimes, like with Raindrops, we tried a couple of other people singing that song and uh, ended up leaving my original vocal just because it seemed to have the kind of, yeah, the new feeling didn't work with another voice. And the song Scars, that had lots of different people trying it, different versions of it, different songs, and what we ended up doing was it's the original version in the background is Felix's voice, and then on top of that is Malika singing it, but a different melody. With Khalees, who came in towards the end, she suddenly gave us a vocal, which we put in, and then Chipmunk did a bit. So that's like a real cut-up of lots of different people. And there's other people in the background as well. So it's kind of a, it's a choir that builds slowly over months. So that went through lots of different phases, and we kind of kept elements of all of it.